Okay, we're over here today. We got um, July 1st. Man. We got, uh, we're out here. Found some remote mines that we need to check out. And just desert. <laughs> And I got Brother Les. We got four wheelers. There's Alan from Mountain Fortress Labs coming with us. We got a couple of mines up here that are on the GPS Google Maps. And uh, my brother has hiked up there before. And uh, but we have never gone down the vertical, so we want to see where what it what it's like. Really pretty out here today. It's about, set, what do you say, 70, 71, 72? Uh, 72, 75. Good hiking weather. It's going to go up to, they say, about 90. Yeah, it'll be hot. That's 110. And, you know, and uh, they got this old, old, old road right here, but I don't think it's going to go up high enough. We're going behind this mountain. And on the top of, like, top of that next mountain that you see. And, um, there's, might be a little dig over here. I can see the tree. A little dig right there. Well, I want to get and look, see that mountain with the rocks. I want to get on top of that rock. That'll be so fun. Check out the scenery. And, uh, so we're just getting set up right now. About 10 o'clock in the morning. And we'll keep you posted. Okay. Okay, we're down here at the bottom of this foothill of that big rock. And uh, four wheelers. They're trying to find a way up closer, but there comes Alan down this road. Another road that comes up over this way. Wonder where that one goes. And uh, Let's go. You went back that way. You gotta go this way. Yeah, you went back down. You didn't know where you went. <laughs> I don't know the exact way to get up there. So they're just going around. I'm on foot. So I'm gonna hike up through here. Through this little canyon. And get on top of that rock. It'll be a really cool view up there so I want to do that first okay okay four wheelers got stuck it's gravel in that little gully there's Alan and you follow this over here that tree is right in the trail and the big rocks right here tree Alan tried to come up right here but he just slipping and sliding it looks like that was the road that went up or right here and we're headed right there to the mountain so everybody's hiking now I got some food and my Mountain Dew, of course. And I have a little bit of water in there, not much. But the Jeep's just down there. It's not not even a mile, so not a, not a big worry. Okay. Real pretty area, though. Real nice. Okay. There they go. And then the mine is right there gotta go over this hill and down and up what okay. yeah and then supposed to be some over here too okay, okay. okay. and then right here the little valley we're on top of the hill the first little hill
Yeehaw! There it is. I mean, I'm gonna get over there at some point. That'll be a cool view. And that's that road that we came up and we had to stop just right down there on the flat. And then over here, there's another road that goes somewhere. And so we're gonna be hiking this valley. Now this might, I'm just gonna throw it out there. This, this is before, like way over there is Dugway. Oh, way over that way. So they might find a body in this mine of Susan Powell. Very unlikely because of the hike. But this is the area of the Dugway Mines. So I'm gonna keep an eye out for any possible burial things. And there, uh, there's a road that goes over this hill onto that side, so I might check that out later. And I don't see any, right now, you know, out if buried out here it would be pretty isolated. Okay, but I gotta catch up. Okay. Can we go, just keep going up here? Yeah. You got me? Yeah. Yikers. <laughs> we can go around like this way. This is the way, look, this is the way to go. Man, this is where we're going, see? Right there, see there's piles and piles. Up through there. Oh, the top of the mountain. And look at the view over here. There's the road, way right down there. You can see all the whole valley. Okay. Okay, look at this view. And right over there is what they call Rainbow Mines. There's a cabin down there, old cabin. And then if you go this way a little bit more is a four metal mine where I where I fell down the mine shaft that one time. But look at this hills right here. These are all behind. It looks like there's a road over there, going up. Somewhere over there is probably a mine. And then... You were asking about over here? Right there is the little rock knoll. Yeah, we've been there. There's a car up Buick or something. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I wouldn't have to verify. And then, right, you can see our Jeep way down there. Shining. Right next to it is a water conservatory for the rangers they measure the, the rainwater and so yeah come quite a ways a couple miles and then over there supposed to be some more mines the road right there it goes up now on google maps it shows shows this mine and then right here in front of us is a mine. We're gonna be right there in a couple minutes. And right here we found some really heavy quartz. And uh, looks like a vein of metal. Alan's checking it out. But this is a really cool view up here. It's hot now. Uh, I had to stop because I got dizzy. I'm having a, what is it called, a uh, elevation sickness a little bit. I have got a little dizzy. We don't see anything right off, but it's very heavy. It could just be some of the minerals inside that you uh, can't really see very well. So we'll probably take a couple samples and just keep on hiking. Yeah. Wait a minute, 
this area here. I have small little pieces, but that red, it might be something in there. Right there is, you can tell, lead galena. Yeah, right there it might be something. I'm gonna guess this area here. Right here. Yeah. yeah. Is a galena. Yeah, right there, uh, right I there. That's an iron. Yeah, but right in right there, see right in here? Yeah. So in the transition area parts. This isn't so... Oh, this jeez. That one just blew to pieces. This isn't very heavy. Whoa, this one's still heavy. This one's heavy. Yeah, go by the weight. You packed that hammer all the way up here? You bet. I mean... Holy moly. I mean, if you find a sample, you want to do it without carrying all the overburden. Well, there's the fluorites in there, too, right there. Pretty cool. Oh, oh there's the fibers. Is that heavy? Yeah. Look at that one again. There's partial of mixed metals in there, probably. There's a bunch of different stuff. You got calcium, you got fluoride, you got iron, you got lead, silver. See, I actually like... There's got to be parts per million gold in it. I like this one, but this one's really weird. It's really heavy. Still. That's like it's the core of it. And it's abnormally heavy for calcium. Yeah. Calcium's light. I know. I'll take these two pieces. Okay. Hey, let's get her set up. Got a rope going down. I'm not feeling that good today. I've gotten dizzy hiking up here, so I'm not gonna go down. Gonna stop doing that crack cocaine would be better. Oh. Nope. <laughs> cocaine breakfast. Forgot to bring some for lunch. I had, I had two bananas for breakfast and then for the potassium. Uh, it doesn't seem to be helping. YouTube. Ah! You're always hurting yourself. I know. I used to get hurt, and then I, I liked it when I was young, you know, because it you made like me feel like hurt? a big tough guy. Yeah. Kind of still now you got scars. I love the scars. Scars are better than tattoos. Yeah. You're a strange guy, Les. Scars are beautiful. Battle wounds. Scars, you can tell your grandkids what you've done. Uh, you know, that's right. <laughs> I thought I was doing, doing a lot of things for prosperity and filming and writing in a journal. And I know my kids grew up and they said, Ew, I don't care tell them about you. Tell them about you. It had nothing in there about us. Okay, well, we'll get our set up and... Okay. Alan looks like Alan's gonna go down first. Got it from there, Scott. Yeah. We are in the middle of nowhere. Up on top of this beautiful ridge. I got this, this is stainless steel, mm. and it won't wear out like all those aluminum ones. Yeah. My other alum I've got aluminum beaners. I got some stainless steel beaners. Oh, I got yelled at for it. And uh, what? Uh, anyway, mm -hmm. I got somebody making a lot of noise next to me. Uh huh. Who might that be? <laughs> kids are 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 seen and not heard, right? 
something like that. I almost could use this thing flipped around. Yeah, flipped around. Oh, good spot right here. You see any dead bodies down there? Yell us, yell at us. Uh, Might be Susan Powell, but very unlikely. Just saying, hiking up here in the. No, uh, these hills. I don't think she would have dragged the body up this far. Swapped around. Well, it's like uh, a tiny little hole, but it opens yeah. way wide. Right there. You're gonna be swinging in the air. Good thing you're skinny. Nope, there he goes. here for 50 feet holy smokes what there is like a crystal scene right here that is pretty amazing what is a crypto scene crystal crystal oh. that's that crystal rock that you guys been looking at is that calcite or yeah it's that it's that heavy calcite that we saw they're following it mm. Oh, it's nice and cool in here. I'll bet. Yeah, it's getting hot out here now. Oh, it feels good. Soak it in. Soak it up. If it was winter, it would be freezing. So get used to it. I'm getting kind of hungry. Hey, Les. Nice and cool in here. What do you say? Nice and cool in there. Well, oh, yeah. Come down, just be careful. It's, they seem to got it cribbed pretty good. Are you at the bottom? Yeah. Oh. I'm off the rope. He's off the rope. Well, if it just goes down 25 feet, what's the point? Let's yeah. go to the next one. Well, I just feel like uh, taking a five minute break in this air condition. Yeah. Yeah, take a break. But they do have, here we got is a, uh, you're following that theme of uh, cow. Oh, wait, they keep going. There's uh, a little teeny wormhole going on. Oh. Well, check it out real quick and see if it's worth me coming down. Wow. It's just a tiny green hole. I don't want to knock shit on top of you. What? I don't want to knock stuff down on top of you. Let me get in a little bit. Okay, we found a little vertical. Uh, right there's the other piles and on the other side or I mean uh, horizontal sorry guy I'm gonna go in here uh, there's the glasses, Alan, right in the door. <laughs> and in the way Oh, it is cooler in here. It's nice and cooler in here. I can't believe you guys are rushing out on the heat. No, I'm not. I'm just saying. It's cooler. I got water dripping. I got. It. Looks like a dead end here. There's that calcite line. Mouse, ah! All right. This is neat. Comes in and opens right up. Look at the rock formation. Looks like, you know, lines. Really soft. It's been, it's kind of moist in here. 
from all the rain this winter. Got a uh, piece of wood. Yeah, it goes in here a little ways. Now it's really getting muddy mud. It's bigger than I thought it was going to be. Bunch of weird little diggy digs. Not quite like the blood pool I found in the other one. This one's like orange. Pretty weird. Stinky. Orange stinky. Yeah. Dripping from the surface through the cracks. And then I still got this passage going over. There's a here. nest. So I think it ends. The pine clippings. Wait, what is that? Urine? That's just a pool of water. Must be dripping from the ceiling over there somewhere when it rains. Well, it's, that's dead ends to the animal nest. Another rat nest, huh? No oh. bats in here though. I haven't seen a bat. That's weird. Really neat. It was just black, black uh, slate rock. Okay, that's the end of it. Okay, here goes Les. Down the hatch. Down the hatchway. Oh boy. It's going in. Flashlight. Uh, yeah. Oh. <sighs> Dirt down my pants. Keeps you clean. Wow. In the middle of nowhere, this big old hole is now. Brush off my pants. Go down my. Nice because you can stand up, but there's no no rails, so somebody's been in here. No rail? Rail cart, rails. That's all wet and caved in. Little dead end here. Ooh, look at the mold. It's a black mold. Or it might be roots. Those are those are roots from the above ground. So we're close to the surface. Right here. Just caved in. Ow. Ow. Bump my head. Getting really skinny and narrow here. Oh. Yeah, we have another main passage to follow too. But and water. Out in the water dripping. Wow. Mm -hmm. And that's just water. 
This is the one that's really interesting right here. It's not heavy black, though. Black crystals. Mm. It's just black dirt in a pocket. Pretty cool. Yeah. It stops back there. That clay over oh, right there, yeah. That's what they're following. Clay vein. Okay. Uh, horizontal? Okay, this is up there with the horizontal and vertical. The, the vertical we're looking at is right in front of you, Alan, between me and you. That's one. We're at this big tailings. There it is. Yeah, there's a big horizontal right here. And then they're they're gonna go down. That one's scary because if anything falls, it's gonna hit you on the head. And there's so much debris around it. And it's gonna be a scary one. Here, the trail, kind of animal trail. Are you guys gonna go in that one or this one? This looks like bunch of vertical stuff inside I'll go see what are there I don't want to go in a separate one dropping my Loose dirt. <laughs> There's a lot of material here. Here's the other vertical. There's another vertical. That one doesn't go down very far, but yeah. Did you guys do take a nap in there? We're just sitting there resting. It don't look like that goes very far. Well, might not. Slide down there, you'll go into the other vertical. How far are you in there? Uh, I think the total length may be like uh, 80 feet. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, we're going in this horizontal. There's a, a little worm tunnel going down, but looks like it's all caved in. Oh.
Wow. That's behind you. It's like it, it, uh, it, it was probably another entrance, but it uh, collapsed in. Wow. Something's been you know, uh, how hot it is outside. It's really moist everywhere. Mm. Yeah. Boy, some animals have sure been grabbing stuff. Yeah. That's where that other worm tunnel comes through. Yeah, well that was not very much. Okay. Yeah. And there's the front. <clears throat> Okay, we're in the next one. It's just a little right next to it. It looks like it ends though. Yeah. Yep. Why would you dig this? And dead end. Big dead end. Uh, they're probably trying to find <coughs> some main more from or... that, yeah that they were doing with that uh, vertical. I'm just gonna try a little hole, see if it goes anywhere. Just slides down in. That's it. Ah! What the hell? I gotta crawl out of that damn thing. Yeah. I might need a hand. Okay. Let me get situated. There you go. There we go. That's better. <laughs> okay. Okay, I gotta clear a little bit of sagebrush out. Um, I'm gonna tie a rope over to this big bush. Huge mine, and it's very, very far away from the main mine claims. But this is a main working. I'm just worried about there's wood right here, or it's all loose. Yeah. But those won't fall as long as you don't touch them. This is That's a huge top. tree. I guess there is a second tree right here, huh? Yeah. I gotta go see. No, not yet. Okay, when I get it all clear, we'll turn on. Well, he already jumped down, okay. That's just jumped in there, don't give me time. And going down and disappearing. You at the bottom? Yeah. What do we got? In. What? Just filled in. Oh. Ah. That's it? Nothing, no horizontals, no. No, we do. Uh, it's all back filled in. Whatever was all up there has come in and filled it up. I'm like, uh, what? 15 feet from you? I think more about 20. About 20. Um, okay. No area that even looks like we could even dig a little. I'm gonna poke around a little bit. Okay. We'll do that. 
I'm gonna stand back so I don't knock any stuff on me. You're dropping stuff on me. Yeah. You moved out of the way. It looks like there might have been another vertical right next to it here. But it's full in, filled in. That sucks. After all this time, one of the biggest ones out here. Okay. Are you filming me? <laughs> I didn't get you going down. Sometimes I feel like you and Alan are really pretty and charismatic and popular, and I feel like I'm just an ugly old guy. We all are. So I get resentful. I don't have no girlfriend. I'm not pretty. If I was pretty, I'd have a girl. Love you. Huge tracts of land. Ten acres. Ten acres and a mule. And a mule. <laughs> oh, One weeds. Of the biggest digs out here. Nothing. Disappointment. There's nothing in there. It's all caved in. <coughs> Not even bones. Okay, thanks for watching. Okay, look, here's the rock. I'm gonna climb up and see the view. There's the Jeep down there. They're on the four-wheelers. I said I want to climb the rock. They said, okay. And, uh... There's another mine over there on top of the hill. See the orange. Uh, they want to go check that one out. So I got to hurry and get up this rock. This side is uh, another canyon. I'm seeing if there's another mine up this one, but I don't see anything. So pretty steep. Look at this. It's just like a stairway up to the top here. And we'll just see. Hopefully it just goes like this all the way up. That'd be cool. I don't have to really climb that much. A little pathway. <laughs> I'm getting closer.
Whoa. We're on top of the world. Ooh. Look at that. It's just straight down. Straight over. This side is pretty much the same. And that's a little bit treacherous right there. Okay. Put my right here. Put my bag down so I can climb better. Just narrow rocks. <sighs> Gotta switch hands, put my feet in good spots. Woo There's a top right there. Okay, one more little thing here. If you trip, you're done. That's just sure down. And this side's not as bad, but it's still steep. There we go. like somebody's over there and that's four metal mine and it goes up over to Kelly's hole and that's rainbow mines right in there and then we're gonna head down now we're gonna go over to that red spot right there okay that was fun thanks for watching